So we are being told to find uh, the value of x. Uh, the value of x. What is the value of what? X. That's what we are being told to find. Now we have been given this triangle where A, C, E, and uh, B, C, T. These two are straight lines. A, C, E, and B, C, D. These are straight lines. Then angle B, A, C, this is what? X. Then angle D, C, E, this is what? 2X plus 15 degrees. Then we have been told to find what? The value of X. Now what you need to do is, uh, in this case, be very observant. Look at the type of triangle we've been given. This type of triangle is called uh, an isosceles triangle. Okay? Because it has these two sides are equal. Uh, AB and AC. AB and AC. AB, uh, AB and AC. These two are equal. AB and AC. These are what? These are equal. So since these two are equal, AB and AC. This these two are equal. The best angles at point G, B and point C, these are going to be equal as well. Okay? Yes. He said the best angles of an isosceles triangle what? are equal. So which ones are best angles? So this angle, this angle, and this angle are going to be what? Are going to be equal. This angle, this angle, and this angle are going to be equal. Since this is our, what? our isosceles triangle, which is triangle A, B, C. So since this is an isosceles triangle, AB and AC, these are, are equal, okay? Because these are the what? The base angles, okay? So this angle and this angle are what? Are equal, okay? So I'm saying uh, angle A, B, C is equal to angle A, C, B. A, B, C, and angle A, C, B. These two are equal. Why? Because these are the best angles of what? An isosceles what? Triangle. Okay? Yes. Now, since uh, A, C, E, and B, C, D, these are straight lines crossing. Vertical opposite angles are also equal. Okay? So, we're saying vertical opposite angles mean that vertical opposite angles are equal. So, if this is what? Two x plus 15. This one is also 2x plus 15 because uh, angle D, C, E and angle A, C, B. These are basically what? Opposite. So if this is what? This is what? 2x plus 15. This one is also going to be what? 2x plus 15. Why don't we move it together? Yes. Now remember we said uh, angle A, B, C and angle A, C, B. These are equal. So if this is 2x plus 15, this one is also going to be what? 2x plus 15. How do you move it together? Yes. So these are the base angles of this isosceles triangle. Base angles of an isosceles triangle what? Are equal. Okay. So in this case, our way to find x. Since we have on this triangle, this is a triangle term. Our triangle is like this. So we have a triangle which is looking like this. A triangle which is like this. This is the way triangle is. Uh, this is A. This is B. And uh, we have C. Okay? And this is uh, X. This is angle B. A, C is X. Uh, and then we have this one. We know this one is what? It's 2X plus 15. And this one is 2X plus 15. So we have the three angles of this triangle. Okay? This one is X. Uh, this one is 2x plus 15, and this one is 2x plus what? Plus 15. So we can easily find the value of x. Since we know that uh, the sum of angles in a triangle add up to 180. The sum of interior angles of a triangle add up to what? Uh, 180. Okay? So we can now find uh, the value of what? x. So I'm going to say we have this angle, which is angle, angle B, A, C, plus. Angle A, B, C plus angle A, C, B. This one. You have this one. Angle B, A, C. This is the angle. Then angle A, B, C. A, B, C plus this angle, this angle A, C, B is equal to what? 108. Okay. So what is our angle B, A, C? B, A, C is what? X. So it's the X. 
plus what is our um, ABC? ABC, ABC is what? 2x plus 15 plus what is this angle? ACB. ACB is 2x plus 15. Is equal to what? 180 degrees. Okay? So we can now uh, group the right terms. So we have got x, this x plus 2x plus 2x. Then you have what? Uh, 15 plus 15 plus what? Uh, 15 is it? Okay, is equal to what? 180. Okay? So we can add the like terms. So you say x plus 2x, you get 3x. 3x plus 2x, you get what? 5x plus 15 plus 15, you get what? 8. Okay, is equal to 180 degrees. Okay, then you say 5x is equal to 180 degrees when transport and weight of what? Minus 30 uh, degrees. You say 5x is equal to 180 minus uh, 30, you get what? 150. So for us to remain with x, divide both sides by the quotient of x, which is 5, we say by what? Right. These two are going to go. The quotient of x is equal to, uh, we know that 5 into 15 is what? It's 3, so we have 30. 30 degrees. So 30 degrees is the value of what? The value of x. Okay. Yeah.